Um, I'm going to speak right now just to the one issue about the racial disparity of corporal punishment in the schools, because this is something that simply cannot be denied. And first I want to explain how the Department of Education keeps these statistics, because it's critical to understand how it is that we, we arrive at these statistics. First of all, the Department of Education says that probably the statistics are underrepresented of the number of beatings taking place in the schools. So you can bank on the fact that whatever we do have is, if anything, it underreports how many beatings are taking place. But this is the key to me. First, when a child is beaten in school, they are reported for that school year one time. They are not reported again, no matter how many times they are hit during that academic year. So if a particular child is hit one time or a hundred times, it's reported as one incident with the Department of Education. Okay, now keep that in mind when we talk about who's getting hit in schools. Because there's been a lot of research on who are the kids, who's being hit. Well, the clearest indication is kids who are poor are getting hit. Kids in the poor rural school districts are the ones getting hit, not so much in the urban districts. But we know for a fact that black children are hit disproportionately. Um, one study showed that black boys are 16 times more likely to be hit in schools than white girls. Now we like to stop hitting me. Yeah. Boys are hit more than girls, and black children are hit more than white children. You paddled last year in eighth grade. A lot, or a little bit. We, when you start crunching these statistics, what you have is situations in which particular black boys are hit so frequently that they drop out of school. I think that those beatings have impacted your life. If they have never done that again, it's been a thing to me, right? It's been like the same without hit me, trying to punch me like that and things like that. I think I would have finished school. Oh, really? Yes, ma'am. And then what happens to them? Where are they going to go? What would you do? What bothers me the most, I think, about these statistics is that the kids who are being hit in school are the kids who are already from troubled homes. These are the kids our government should be taking care of. These are the, the kids our government should show concern for, our government should nurture, our government should help, and they're not doing that.